Hi everyone and welcome to another video. This is the first fashion video of 2023. So I'm super excited to be doing a Fashion Nova haul today. It is going to have a little bit of a twist on it though. I have done a video like this before where I do a try on haul and show you how I would style that certain piece. So today is going to be something similar like that. Um, I'm going to be showing you all the pieces that I got from Fashion Nova and also challenging myself to kind of like style it on the spot or just like style it in front of the camera <laughs> so you guys will be able to see my thought process and how i put together pieces we'll be trying things on taking things off just try to create an outfit from a singular piece so the theme of this haul and the pieces that i got are a bit more feminine girly things that are my personal style i've always been one to dress more girly and feminine soft and all of that that has pretty much been my style for ever <laughs> so um yeah that's like my favorite way to dress so with that being said let's jump straight into the video so the first piece is this i call it a candy dress because it really just reminds me of candy it's colorful it's pink i love pink pink is my favorite color it's in this knitted um material and i what i love one of my favorite styles on blouses and dresses are trumpet or bell sleeves trumpet bell or lantern sleeve that's what they typically call um, this type of sleeve so it has quite a huge sleeve it doesn't look that big but it looks big when you wear it the sleeves are just very exaggerated it has a cut out at the back um, I could have done without it honestly I could have done without it but it's there regardless I feel like I want to style this with like I know the lazy way of styling well according to me a lazy way of styling is like picking a color that's on your outfits and like accessorizing with it so like throwing on heels of that color or throwing on a bag or shades but i just feel like there's no other way this is there's so many colors in this dress i wouldn't want to add i mean lime green would go so beautifully with this dress and this color combination but i like this is enough color for me so i don't want to like add more color that would be an option if you want to like add some lime green if you want to add like more color you could definitely accessorize but i'm thinking of just adding of just picking a color on the dress and accessorizing with this so let's see how i styled this dress so the dress is on looking so nice i'm going to pick a color on the dress and try to style that so i have a yellow bag and yellow heel so let me quickly put that on and see I haven't even put on both heels yet and I'm not feeling the yellow. This is how it looks. I'm not feeling it. So it was gonna be like that. The yellows are just very different. I don't know what color. Maybe I just have to go with pink. Orange. Maybe I could go with orange. So these are the orange heels and this is the orange bag. I like this way better. Way better. This is the outfit. Now, it would not be a Ruth for Lauren haul without a two piece. <laughs> I'm even currently wearing a two-piece. Two pieces are my brand. I was just telling my mom the other day, like, I don't know if you've noticed this, but whenever I'm going somewhere and you tell me like five minutes in advance, I throw on a two-piece because it's just like easy styling. So I have a gray two-piece here from Fashion Nova and I will save this in all my Fashion Nova hauls because honestly the quality caught me off guard i feel like when people talk about fashion over obviously they talk about fast fashion and you know things of that regard but why don't you talk about the quality because when i think of fast fashion i'm just like mm, you know it was just like made quickly the quality of this piece is phenomenal like it is so heavy like i wish you guys could feel it is so heavy it seems like i'm already in winter <laughs> the last piece was like a wool dress this is like a sweater material but yeah it's the sweater material turtleneck um top and the pants are once again this sweater material 
full really long leg pants and the pants flare out a bit such a flattering two-piece like you guys will see on the model and you'll also see how I style it in a few seconds but so flattering this is just giving me like boss babe vibes like when I walk in sit up straight when I'm wearing this piece like don't play with me so I think my styling will be bold I'm thinking of adding maybe like some silver jewelry and just like making this really like hard girl <laughs> you know boss babe vibes but let's see what I do let's see how I style it I love this I love it so much and as I predicted it's definitely giving boss so I want like a bold I want bold accessories so I'm thinking definitely black shades like all black shades I don't know if I want to do a hoop or not or if I should just keep my studs um, and then for heels and a bag I want color so and I also want pumps <laughs> I have a lot of expectations for this outfit so I don't want like a strappy heel I want like a pump so that it can like peek out through the heel I mean so it can peek out through the pants I have black pumps which I'm not trying to do I have red pumps that I just got um, I have blue pumps from Fashion Nova so maybe we can do blue so these are the blue pumps these are the red okay so these are the blue pumps um, but they're not giving me what I want now I'm wondering if pumps are gonna give me what I want at all so let's try on the red Oh yes, I feel like this is perfect. Oh, I don't want to do a red bag because I feel like that's just really lazy. Um, what colors work with red? Blue. This I think works perfectly with the gray number one, and then with the red. So we have a gold necklace, black shades, black bag, oh! <laughs> and red heels. I just need a second I just need a second because let me not even say anything I just show you the dress excuse me excuse me <laughs> best believe this girl is coming out on the 14th of February just best believe because hello I was just talking about how much I love feathers. So it has feathers. And now we have some sequins. I am not a sequins girl at all, but I saw this dress. I was like, add to cart. No questions asked. Not worried about anything. I typically don't like sequins because it can get quite itchy. And I mean, the, the inside of this dress is lined, but then the arms are not lined. So I'll see um, when I style it. Hopefully it's not itchy. But I didn't ask any questions. I said, you're coming home with me, babe. Like, you're coming home with me. Hello? Hello. Like, wow. 14th of February, you and I. But let's see how I end up styling this dress. So my girl is on. Oh, so good. So, so good. I love this dress. I think this is going to be really easy to style because... Is either you're going completely red or you're making the dress the star of the show and I think I want to make the dress the star of the show so I'm gonna accessorize with black the only question is do I want a strappy black heel or a pump okay so I got two black heels um, either this fashion over pump or the Louboutin I feel like both could really work. Strappy heel is on. I feel like it's perfect. Let's try this again. Ooh, this is tricky. So we either have the, the court heel or the strappy heel. I don't know. This is so tricky. This is gonna be really easy to style. 
two bags. I still haven't decided on the heels. I'm hoping that this will help me. So either this Zara bag or this, um, what is this? I don't know what this is, but I got it from Miniso. It's really dependent on what event because if I'm going to somewhere more serious, which I don't know where I'm going seriously wearing this red dress, but if I'm going somewhere more serious, maybe I'd wear this with a cord heel or somewhere like fancy evening vibe where you just need your phone, your card. I would have this bag and just like a very light, not too serious heel, you know? This is actually really difficult. And I think I'm gonna go with the strappy heel. All right, so I only have one blouse in this haul. I feel like blouses are very fitting for like a very feminine and soft look. Definitely one of my favorite things to throw on with a pair of jeans. Um, I just feel like, I just look very like beautiful and soft. That's just how I see blouses, especially when they have a trumpet, lantern or bell sleeve. <laughs> Once again, I just really love these like accentuated sleeves. They just really, mold your body in my opinion like you have these like really big sleeves and then your whole waist just like is sucked in this is a corset style so all the better um so i just feel like they're very very flattering on women so i ended up getting this in a size medium i get all corset tops in a medium just because i don't want it to be too cropped and then sides of my stomach are like hanging out i'm just very mm, weird about that so i prefer my whole stomach to be covered rather than it to crop if that makes sense so i always size up anyways let's see how i styled this piece okay definitely from the get-go i know that something needs to be on my decolletage <laughs> well when last did i say that word this um sleeve is like inspiring me to go for like a balloon jean i'm feeling a nude a nudeness so maybe like a nude bag okay so i'm gonna go with this nude bag and these heels yeah i like this i like this i like this a lot i don't know actually i feel like this is a very boring look do i actually like this outfit i don't know i don't know what it is should i change the heels putting on some mom jeans i've definitely lost weight so i'm very confused oh exactly i like this i feel like it's very basic but definitely more character than that bland jean oh the orange looks really good in the camera or should i still go with the wangs Yes, and I think I still have agency to wear nude, even with this orange. I'm gonna tie my hair up, and then I think that's it. And it does not get any more feminine and girly than a floral dress. So I have this, I would say it's floral. There's actually no flowers, but I mean, what else am I gonna call it? A printed dress? That's boring. I feel like it's floral. In my eyes, it's floral. It's definitely not floral. But <laughs> yeah, this is a maxi dress. I can't even show you how it is right now. You guys will see in the styling portion and on the model. But once again, it has a bell or like trumpet sleeve, the most flattering on my body. And it just makes me feel like expensive and important. I don't know, like there's just something. Maybe it's the Yoruba girl in me and the whole Agbada thing, like where you just, <laughs> I feel like there's not much I can say about this piece. You're just gonna have to see it on and see how I style it. So let's have a look how I end up styling this dress. It is so beautiful. I feel like 
it's just a very like farmer's market Sunday dress. Maybe we could do like nude or gray. Let's do nude. These sandals or slippers, they're from Fashion Nova. I'm pretty sure they're inspired by Valentino. Nude bag. Uh, yep. I feel like that's the outfit actually. A necklace. And these. Oh, yes. I feel like this whole haul has been feathers and trumpet sleeves. That has been this haul. <laughs> I'm definitely a creature of habit, but I have this beautiful, beautiful, my first Nova Luxe um, item. Nova, Fashion Nova has a Luxe collection, in case you didn't know. And I got this beautiful white dress with feathers. <laughs> Once I saw this, it just gave me elegant lady i will say there's certain pieces in my closet that i know i won't reach for for the next year or two um just because they may age me but i know that i need in my 20s i don't know if anyone else is like that maybe it's just me trying to justify a shopping addiction and just like buying things to store in my closet but there's many pieces in my closet that i'm like i love you so much but i'm not wearing you anytime soon i just i just know that i'll need you one day and i feel like this is one of them um, what a beautiful dress, but I think I'm 23 This is giving very much like maybe 24 25. Maybe it's just how my mind thinks but Yeah, it's just too much of a beautiful and elegant dress if that makes sense. I Need to be in my serious girl era since when do I say era, but <laughs> I need to be in that era for me to wear this but it's beautiful and it's feminine and that's the vibe of today's haul so i left it for last let's see how i style this final dress just as i thought i feel older than i am if maybe actually if it was like a bit tighter i feel more mature you know i think the mission right now would be to bring my youth back let's just add a color I think pink because pink is getting girly pink is not a childish color but i can add some youthful character to this dress with the color pink i think my battery is flashing please don't do this to me right now i feel like strappy heels are a bit more youthful oh you see oh i can add some pearl no pearls will make me look old okay Maybe I can do that. That will work, right? A pink bandeau and then a white bag. Let's see. Ooh, this is so pretty. I think this is fine. I think I like this. I like this outfit, so. all right guys and that concludes my styling video did you like it please let me know give this video a thumbs up if you don't want to comment but i'd really appreciate co your comments i love interacting with you guys in the comments but yeah remember to subscribe remember to comment and remember to like the video and i'll see you in my next video bye guys <laughs>